Saturday is sponsored by AT&T Business from Daryl K. Royal, Texas Memorial Stadium. We've got the number one team in the nation. Nick Saban brings his Alabama Crimson Tide into Austin to take on the Texas Longhorns. Hi everybody, I'm Gus Johnson along with my quarterback, Joel Klatt, and welcome to Austin Folk. Austin folks, this should be a good one. Alabama, they've got two superstars Woo. of college football, one on offense that's got a Heisman Trophy, one on defense that many consider is the best defender in college football. These two guys are fabulous. I've loved watching them all week in preparation for this game. Let's start with the quarterback, Bryce Young. What jumps off the tape to me is his intelligence. He is such a smart player. He's accurate with the football. He's got a quick release. You know him and you love him, Bama fans. And if he gets time, he will carve up Texas. Speaking of time, Will Anderson gives none to the opposing quarterback. This guy is a game wrecker. What I love is his talent matched with the effort that he plays with is what's led to these trophies. The Heisman and Nagurski for the first time in college football history. We've got those two trophies together on the same team. These two guys could wind up being the top two picks in the NFL draft. They're that special. As for Texas, they're trying to rebound from a five-win season, but they have something old and something new <laughs> playing for them today. And, and the new is their quarterback, the true freshman, really. And I know he recategorized and had a long road to get here, but Quinn Ewers, the freshman, comes out here very talented, Gus. He's got to get the ball down the field and create big plays. The other thing he has to do is get the ball to his best player, Bijan Robinson. And Bijan Robinson is, I think, the best running back in America. They've got to get him the ball everywhere and every way that they can. Watch him all over the place. The guys have talked about all day. The formations and movement of Steve Sarkeesian, that's going to start with number five, Bijan Robinson. All right, time now to join the third member of our team. Roaming the sideline, battling the heat. Let's go out to the All-American girl, Jenny Tapp. Well, guys, here's something to think about. Steve Sarkeesian would not be the head coach at the University of Texas without Nick Saban. His last stop before coming to Austin was Tuscaloosa, and it's the timing of that stop that's so relevant. Yesterday, Steve Sark Sarkeesian told us, I was a dumpster fire at that point in my career when Coach Saban took a chance on me, and I am forever grateful. We also asked Coach Saban what it was like bringing Sark onto his staff, and he said, I always knew how talented he was. No one is perfect. He's a great guy, he's a great coach, and he was fantastic for us. But guys, there has been so much hype and excitement surrounding this game, and if anyone knows the recipe, how to beat Alabama, Coach Sarkeesian has seen it up close and personal. He said it's the teams that become enamored with facing Bama. That's the teams that struggle. His message to his guys, be enamored with us. Because the parties after the game, after a big win, those parties are a hell of a lot more fun than anything before. All right, Bama won the toss and will receive the football, folks. It's going to be hot today. 84 degrees at kickoff time. It's been hovering in the 90s all week. Darrell K. Royal, Texas Memorial Stadium, opened in 1924. And you take a look, this is the 10th meeting between these two teams. Texas leads it big, but their last meeting was a big one in the 2010 BCS Championship which turned out to be Nick Saban's first national championship at Alabama. Will Stone will kick it off for UT. Kool-Aid McKinstry, back deep. And Stone sends it away. And this one fielded at the goal line. And Alabama crosses the 20 up to the 23. Looks like that was Jameer Gibbs, who also wears number one, returning the kick. And a flag on the play. Jalen Ford with the tackle on special team. Scott Campbell is your referee today. During the return, holding number two, return team. Half the distance of the goal. 